Gas prices are slowly on their way down, but still higher than last year. Now, despite that, AAA says more Americans will hit the road this weekend for the Memorial Holiday. However, here in New Mexico, we found a lot of people saving their cash and planning their weekend closer to home. News 13's Amanda Goodman reports. It's a good weekend to stay home and do stuff here. And there is plenty to do, from pedal boats to picnics and fishing. A lot of New Mexico families are sticking close to home this holiday weekend. We're fishing all day today, catching a lot of catfish, and um, we're going to work on our old cars and probably go hiking. The Coon family is one of those families. They're taking a staycation, planning to hang out in Albuquerque and take advantage of what the city has to offer, all while saving some cash. Yeah, we're broke. <laughs> But yeah, we're staying in town this weekend, so it's too crowded everywhere else. Places like Elephant Butte are expecting crowds in the tens of thousands, and there are the national forests and parks. However, some of them won't have any visitors from Memorial Day. High fire danger forced them to close. You won't find a closed sign here. All Albuquerque City pools flip their closed signs to open just in time for the holiday weekend. Plenty of families took advantage, enjoying the low-cost entertainment. I wish we could have went somewhere, you know, camping or something at least, but not this year. Ricardo Altriste says scheduling conflicts ruined his family's plans to head out of town. So instead, they too headed to the local fishing hole to kickstart their long weekend. I love coming over here and bringing the kids here to Tingley. And uh, we have a good time here in town. So I think that uh, that's a good thing for, for us here. You know, we don't have to go out. Uh, too, too far. Families like the Coons say with so many things to do around town, they may need a vacation once the staycation is over. Hopefully we get to sleep in at least one of the days. In Albuquerque, Amanda Goodman, KRQE News 13. And for a list of more events happening this weekend, including parades and, of course, what the weather will be like, head to krqe.com.